determining someone's income for um, child support and alimony can be challenging at times. It's not so challenging if you've got a W-2 employee. However, you also, pursuant to the new case law Kavanaugh in Massachusetts, you also have to look at all the perks and all the benefits that someone receives in that employment, that W-2 employment, and try to quantify those for child support. And for people that are self-employed, own a business, determine their own salaries, those types of things are difficult. Usually, I will retain an expert on behalf of my client um, to determine what the most appropriate amount of income that they should be deriving from the asset. Because someone could be earning a very low salary and accumulating money into in the business and and basically, you know, retaining the um, all of the profits and not distributing them. It's got to be determined. It's got to be looked at as a whole as to how the income stream versus the value of the business is determined. (music) 